Welcome to Victorian Gardens Cattery. Today is January 18th, 2018, and we're in Petunia's nursery at the toddler room. She's got four babies, two black and white Persians, one Lily, Lily's on the right, and Victorian is on the left. And then we have two rambunctious kittens. They've always been rambunctious, these two. Um, the little girl on the left is named after her mom. Her name's Petunia Grace. She's a little black Persian. And the boy on the right <laughs> um, is out of the blue. And we name him Indy or Indigo um, as a nickname. He's staying at the cattery as a future breeder. He's a, a blue Persian. Victoriana. Victoriana was in a, um, a video not too long ago. There's Victoriana. They all just had their baths. They're all plump. They're, um, we've got a couple that are hitting the four pound mark or over the four pound mark in the slitter. Um, they're 13 weeks old today, and um, one leaves tomorrow for her new home, and that's Lillian over there, the black and white, and then two leave on Saturday. What? Victoria Anna is going all the way up to Alaska, so she's got a long, long flight ahead of her. And uh, the last night they're all together, we put out all their receiving blankets on the floor so that they'll sleep on them and get their scent on them so that they take them with them uh, when they go. And they'll be able to smell their mommy and dad, uh, mommy, who's Petunia, and their siblings on their blankets. These blue blankets um, were provided by True Panion uh, Insurance. Um, pet insurance and uh, all of our kittens go with a true panion certificate for 30 days of free insurance um, and so they provided these blankets that we can rub on them and uh, they'll have that in their new homes and they'll be able to smell their mommy and their siblings and be uh, have a little bit more comfort Lillian! Lillian! You want to show your face? We can get a close-up of her. There's Victoriana. She's gorgeous. Petunia! Are you playing with your baby? She probably can't see her. She's all black. Uh-oh, somebody's chewing on it. There won't be much left of it once you chew on it. Now this, we've had this for several years, and it sat in a box. And we never got it out, and I thought, well, tonight would be a nice time for them to try it out. Um, Indy has a huge coat. I don't know if you can tell that. He's going to be a hyper kid, kitty. <laughs> Almost like he has the red gene in him. Victoriana. She's a pretty girl, aren't you? She's a gorgeous girl. Hey, Petunia. And so is this little girl, Lillian. Lillian. You want to say hi? She was the last to have her bath, so I guess she's going to be cleaning up. Are you going to say hi? <laughs> um, I really noticed that in the stepping stone line, which is um, the father of these kittens, um, the bicolors are definitely have a different personality than the solids. And I've noticed that all along. We've had um, stepping stone line here for probably, I want to say four or five years maybe, maybe a little bit longer. And every time we have a bicolor, it's, they have pretty much the same personality. It's totally different than the other Persian and Himalayans. These are a little bit more timid, those two girls. 
they're very tight, the bicolors together. I don't think they have any toys out because we were going to be cleaning the floors for tomorrow. So I'll have to throw out some balls. That's what we want. We want them to play with the blanket so that their smell gets all over them. These two are really loving. I bet you Indy's not letting his sister play with it, huh? You're not letting your sister play with it? She's playing with something else. <laughs> Indy, you gotta let it go. You can't hog it. You gotta let it go. Our batteries are new, but they're old. I mean, they're, they've been in the refrigerator, but I, they're not like just bought. So I don't know how long these batteries are going to last. But So this toy is called the Cat's Meow. It's right there, but it comes under a whole bunch of different names. And way back when we first started our cattery, we had um, a toy like this. And they always loved it. Batteries never lasted long, though. <laughs> so we found one on sale and we bought it. And then we just never have used it. We've got so many other toys. Uh, they got the little house at Christmas time. And Leone pretty much just tore, tore it apart, but they still love it. I'd say Lillian is getting hyped up right now. And I would say that little Victoriana gold lace primrose over there is just a real, like a little princess. <laughs> she doesn't do anything too, too fast or too too strong, not like these two. <laughs> anyway, um, this is our last litter for actually 2017, so we're going to have to wait a while, um, a couple of months before we have our next litter. We have one girl that we have bred and we're waiting to confirm pregnancy on. And as soon as that mommy has her babies, we'll be posting again. But in the meantime, we are going to be doing some of our recommendation videos and how-to videos. So stay tuned in the next couple of months for those. Um, we've had some requests for certain videos to be done um, to help our parents or help other parents that have kittens or cats. So we will be doing more videos, um, how-to videos or products that we recommend and use here at the cattery so that um, we are going to be doing a food one also. Um, we were using EVO, uh, cat and kitten, uh, dry food. We thought you know, it was the best on the market and unfortunately the company has now closed and so we are having to um, switch all of our new kittens over and we did find actually a step up from EVO and we're very excited about it so we'll tell you all about it um, in the next two months and our new kittens will all be on this new food and we're very excited about it um, so anyway we're gonna say goodbye for now I'm from Victorian Gardens Cattery and Petunia's Nursery and that's Petunia right there. She's an excellent mommy and would rather spend time with her babies than anywhere else in the household. Bye for now.